throughout the year, this band has has broken records. They have done things I've never seen young students do before. They are performing music that I've never seen the bands this young perform before. The piece we just performed, I the first time I performed it was in college. So this piece that a middle school ensemble is performing, I played for the first time in college, and I've seen many, many high school bands do it. And so it's, it's a really neat privilege to get to conduct this with these kind of young musicians. So thank you guys for having the maturity to perform such a harsh piece. Very, very good. All right, so here we go. Our awards this afternoon. Uh, I've got one for each section, woodwind, high brass, low brass, percussion. The student that I've chosen for woodwinds this person, I can't tell you here, here in a second. This person is always in my office, always knocking at the door. Mr. Sturman, what can I do to help? Mr. Sturman, what can I do? And I'm always having to find something for this person to do just to get them busy. And then when they're not busy, when they're not helping me, that person's over sitting in the ensemble, practicing their music, asking me what else can, I, what, what else can you give me? What, what's something harder I can play? So I'd like to give the uh, Outstanding Woodwind Award to Mr. David Rosales. Next is Outstanding High Brass. Many, many people like to give this award to. Uh, there's a lot of, lot of good high brass players in this ensemble. But I've got one student in mind who is always in the band hall, always counting people off. What you don't realize is when during lunch, the students come back in, we have the opportunity to uh, let the students practice during lunch. And I'll hear one, two, ready, and. And I'll hear all these songs start with me sitting in my office trying to scarf my food down. And they'll run through it. And this young lady is generally or usually in the middle of all these students and she pushes her friends to work harder and to do better. And so the outstanding high brass award goes to Miss Melanie Martinez. All right. I'd also like to point out that during all region, Miss Melanie placed first chair in the region 21 area. So congratulations. All right, outstanding low brass. I've got many, many people I give this to, and I'll try to make this short and sweet. There's a student that simply goes above and beyond, and he sets the standard for all the rest of the students, and they strive to be like him, and he does a very, very good job of leaving a legacy here at Judson Middle School. So my low brass award goes to Mr. Ian McCarty. Percussion Award. I'm not going to ask for a drum roll. Okay. <laughs> I thought about it. I'm not going to. Uh, these percussionists have grown so much. When I first got here, uh, they looked at me like a deer in the headlights. Like, what are we doing? Can you please help us? And, and they have grown so much over the years, and they work very, very hard. And throughout the years, we do this thing called a pass-off. And I actually require percussion to pass off. And they had to pass off the exact same thing that I asked every band member to do. And every single percussionist did this, but there's one that stood above the rest, and I'll have to give the Outstanding Percussion Award to Mr. Alex Mount. <laughs> All right, so I want to point out one thing. Um, Outside of Judson Middle School, there are many, many musical opportunities for these students. Some play at church, some play at other places, some play in orchestras. And I have quite a few students who actually participate in the youth orchestra here in Longview. So if you participate in the youth orchestra, would you stand up and be recognized, please? Thank you so much. All right, so the first con... Uh, Contest that we see is all region. The second one in February is called Soul and Ensemble. You heard me say a little bit about it earlier. And these students worked so hard. Everything I gave them, everything I assigned them, they, they said, is this it, Mr. Sturman? I'll bring it back to you ready. And they worked very, very hard and relentlessly before school, during lunch, after school, asking for lessons. And I just want to show and demonstrate. Go ahead and bring them out here. This ensemble sitting in front of you has set a school record. We received a total of 94 medals at Solo Ensemble. Really, really neat accomplishment. 
doing an outstanding job, guys. After the concert, as you leave, make sure you get your medals, okay? All right, so I'm going to go ahead. If you place, if you made a verse division on your solo or ensemble, would you please stand up? so thankful that I get to work with these awesome, awesome young musicians, and it has just been a really neat pleasure to help them grow as a musician and to push them as hard as they can go. Um, outstanding job. Okay, the next thing, we're going to talk about majorettes. Majorettes are twirlers that perform during football games and at pep rallies, and they do a, a dance or routine, and every year we have to redo auditions, and we select a new majorette line. And what, here's the rule, I believe it's, it's not this, once a majorette, always a majorette, that's not the case. They have to go through the audition process again. And so, I want to go ahead and ask, as I call your name, would you please stand up? And these are in alphabetical order, the, the majorettes for 2017 and 2018 are Miss Diana Castillo, Miss <laughs> Alicia Dean. Miss Jenny Harris, Miss Christine Hodges, Miss Kendall Huff, Landry Moore, Chelsea Presley, and Miranda Skinner. These ladies went through a uh, group routine and then a solo routine in front of a panel of judges, and they were selected as the majorettes for 2017 and 18. You may have a seat. Thank you so much. <laughs> Along with major X, we also do what's called a drum major audition, and I'd like to announce the drum major for the year 2017-18. The drum majors for next year are Miss Christine Hodges and Diana Castillo. <laughs> Our drum major last year did an outstanding job. Miss Adriana, go ahead and make your way up here. Go ahead and make your way up here. Where's she at? Miss Adriana Hawkins, where are you at? Stand up. <laughs> They are part of a board, and they are selected as judges. And we went to contests. We performed three prepared pieces, and then we went to another room where I had seven minutes to teach this ensemble a song without playing a single note. A single note. And at the end of that seven minutes, the students had to play straight through the music for the first time and last time. And I'm proud to announce that we received a first division on stage and a first division salary. So congratulations. <laughs> This trophy right here is what they received, and they also signed the back of it. So they will be remembered forever at Judson Middle School. All right. Well, this last piece, I think the students love the best and the most. And uh, this is a song I 